Oh, good morning, everyone. <clears throat> I'm a half hour late, and I, apo I do apologize for that. I do apologize for that. Uh, the reason for it is I slept through my alarm. Um, all of a sudden, I got a poke from Tev, who herself is almost completely asleep. And she says, babe, it's 11. And I'm like, ah, shit. So I, I drag myself out of bed, and I take care of everything at that point. Oh, my word. <clears throat> Thank you so much for the resubscription there, uh, Sands of Five. Sands of Five. No, uh, Katie Rio. <laughs> Sorry. Jeez. Is it clear that I just woke up? I hope it's clear that I just woke up. Mr. Strife, this is the IRS. You are late with your annual bribe to us, so we will be taxing your corporation at 90? 80%? I don't know. That emote is obstructing the lettering. Tax rate to account... Uh, at a bleh, tax rate to account for your back taxes owed. How offensive. How offensive. I don't want anything to do with this. You can take that and just walk right out. Of, uh, get out of here. Get out of here. I have no intention of having anything to do with you at, that, at this rate. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Hello, Eli. Hello, Sansa5. How are you all doing? <clears throat> Man. It's also like wait a minute, let me let me check the allergy report here. Okay. That would be why that I'm feeling the way that I am. We're no longer in extreme territory with trees, but tree is still high. It's come out of extreme. 
gone down past very high, and now we're just at high. No wonder I'm still, like, scratchy. Well, if you're open to it, we can negotiate a fair deal with a bribe. Well, listen, like, I'm open to being bribed at any time. Um, any time whatsoever. You can bribe me all you want, okay? Welcome back to Minecraft, everyone. Finish cooking all of the bricks. So, um, today, today, we will be enjoying some fun times. <laughs> Continuing to work on the station. What I, what I mainly want to focus on today is trying to figure out how some of the alcoves are going to be designed. I hear a Lamborghini will survive. <laughs> Sir, we're telling you to bribe us. No. No, 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 no. If there's anything for me to do, it's, uh... West. If there's anything that I'll do, it will be breaking legs and taking names, okay? Just saying. Just letting you know. Alright, I gotta, I gotta open this. I gotta open the freaking map here. Side shale, okay. So, what I wanna do... What I wanna do here is work on the North Line alcove. Because this is, this is what will lead you... Uh, th this, is, this is the direction that leads you to uh, Strife Solutions, okay? So... I don't want I don't want this to be like small and closed off or anything. I want this to be wider and more open. It's a little bit unfortunate that I I dug the tunnel where I did because I would prefer this to be right like smack in the middle of the wall, but it is what it is. I'll have to make do with it. Um And here's the thing, because this is going to be a, uh, because this is going to be st uh, the, the route to get to Strife Solutions eventually, not yet, but eventually, I want to use the same um, motif as I use for the Strife Tower, which is to say, uh, Nether brick and red nether brick, you know? Which I have a decent amount of right here. Hmm. 
Okay, I hadn't thought about this part. It is separated with a sp with a wall. Um, crap. So sorry, I'm like eating my bagel and I'm not being very vocal. Hmm. you i have tower interior shots from when i was building the place here we go okay god i forgot how good this place looks the solution tower that is um The ground is either made out of gray concrete or it's made out of variations of deep slate. <clears throat> so chat, how was your weekend, eh? How was your weekend? I hope it treated you well. <laughs> My weekend was good. Uh, it was at best just not long enough, which is pretty par for the course, if you will. Hmm. My weekend is technically still going as I'm off today. Well, hey, that that's great. Wish I was in the same situation. You go back. You bleh, you go back tomorrow. Bleh. I I don't blame you for having that type of an attitude about like having to go back. That's not that's not fun. But hey, at least you got another day off. <clears throat> Mondays are Mondays are just bleh days in general, in my opinion. And there's I get a lot of them. You know, I get a lot of bleh Mondays. Okay, well, I've got an idea of what I need to be trying to do, so what, what am I gonna, like, am I, I might have to just abandon the entire concept of, like, separately decorated alcoves because this middle wall is one block thick which means I can't design it for a specific you know theme uh, I think what I'm going to be able to do at most is like create a type of like coloring or something like I might have to heavily rely on making the um I might have to, like, heavily rely on making the, what you call it, um, the, 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 the letters on the back walls. Actually, you know what, I've, yeah, let's, let's, let's give this a shot. Because the letters on the back walls, they could be different, like, colors. So, what if I do, you know, you know, like a, a bright red S on the back, or, no, an N, a bright red N, because this is the north line. Let's, uh, this is the same size wall right here. Let's go ahead and figure out how to do an N. That's true, just chilling now after a morning session with Rebirth. Yeah, I've got a, I got a friend who, who, um, left me a message on Steam about, like, hey, so, like, I'm, I'm playing Rebirth, and man... The first open world area I hit, they, uh...
it's good. I like that. That was that was essentially what he was uh, telling me. It was like, hey, this that's pretty good, you know. Okay, before I do anything with stairs, let's just figure out the basic design of this, I guess. Will that do? I don't know that that'll do. Actually, maybe I do need to have these stairs on me. Oops. That will unfortunately make it lopsided. Like it's going to be more to one side than the other. I just sneezed so hard I felt my brain hit my skull. Oh, jeez, that is no bueno. You actually remind me, um, I used up the last tissue downstairs while I was um, blowing my nose. And... Also, how you doing there, Eli? So, one, two, three, four, five, and this is a six, seven, this is an eight block wide alcove. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, man. <clears throat> God, my freaking nose. Um... I guess this is going to have to do. This is what? One, two, three, four. This is five wide and four tall. No wonder it feels like a weird end. But ends are supposed to be like much thinner, you know? Actually, come to think of it, is it possible for me to make this a tad bit more thin and still make it feel like okay? What, what if I started in the middle? I, I seriously doubt that this is going to look right. But you don't know without trying, you right? You don't know without trying. Nope. Doesn't look right. Does not look right at all. Hmm. 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 God damn it. Right, I should probably get some music on for us. Let me uh let me sort that out. Looks like a deranged Z. Yeah, that's kind of the situation. Golly. <clears throat> okay. Playlists. What do we want to listen to this time? Um, let's give this one a shot. That's this is always a good classic. What if we try to just... Oops, whoops. What if we just try to connect it in some awkward... Awkward manner? That doesn't even look like an N. When in doubt, galaxy. It works. It does work. Man... Why, why do ends got to be so difficult to make? Hmm. 
the unnecessarily wide N is what I what I've got to do. You know, like it's it's the only thing that works here. Um, Okay, so I've more or less concluded that like this is this is gonna be like awkward and difficult, so I'll just I'll just like I'll just leave the red nether brick here. Stuff. I don't wanna drag it upstairs. Um what I will do instead is I will work on just the generic color coding of this entire thing, okay? So, we've got... Four tall. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and ten back. Okay, so... Um, what we want to do... Is basically mirror the, the the scheme back here, but maybe what we want to do is we want to like invert it or something so that most of the the platform is like dark stone, and then the highlighting stone is like the grays. So on that end, maybe what I do is I use something like maybe I'll use like uncut basalt. Um, So let's let's see if we can make that work. Oh my god, they're, they're done already. Okay, um, I've I've got to I've got to continue to work these furnaces up here. Not quite the same as working the pole down at the club, but you know. There's a lot of chores around here that I could stand to finish as well, so... Oh man, I'm so sorry about like the sniffles that I got that I'm doing in your ears, guy. We will also bring in the smooth basalt just to be certain. And somehow Blackstone ended up in there. Did not mean for that to happen. We'll take some Blackstone with me as well. And, let's see, um... You know what I think I'll end up doing for the motif? I will end up doing polished andesite. Because that, that's what makes the most sense to me. BRB, my lamb chops are ready for consumption. Super mutant conspiracy theorist. Oh my god, oh god. My, I don't know that my throat can do it today, man. Jeez, oh, give, me, give me a moment. Polished basalt here. So that that'll that'll be the gateway to it. Yeah? That works. What is this music? It is the uh it is the Mario Galaxy soundtrack. All right. Before I do anything else, I had better take care of this cuz it's going to drive me crazy. Got to take the, the the stone away back here. Fill it in. There we go. That's that's your entry point to the north line. Oh, 
Okay, so, um... The walls in general need to be a nice, smooth, uh, tone. So we'll start with the back wall, since this is the important part, you know? Um... Kind of basic, kind of plain, but I, I don't necessarily have a problem with that. We'll be able to break up this pattern reasonably, ooh, reasonably well. Um, and this is a good use of the basalt that I've been picking up. You know, this is a good use of the ba basalt. Um, ooh, let me let me run back upstairs and grab the lanterns because um, that's that's what this place is supposed to be lit with lanterns. Lantern, we be here. Not many of them, but you'll, you'll do. Um, you know, I might have the iron to to fix this up down below or down in the mine. Well, hello, lying. Are you still packing? How's that move going for you? Oh, you know what? May as well check on this one here. Has the old uh it's it's, it's working away. I'm i so, I'm certain that most of that um most of that auto kelp harvester is like busted now because it was built between chunks. So it just it, it 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 occasionally just does not work. Chunk loading, breaking redstone? No, never heard of it. Um, wrong side of the station. Whoopsie. We are unpacking. Still no. So not done with the move yet. That's a shame. But like, also I get it. Unfortunate, but I get it. So, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Man, I'm going to have to push this wall back at least one layer. I don't want to do that, but, I'm, like, I won't be able to fit in, like, the, the haphazard and awkward-looking uh, letter. Look at me. After I finish putting this back wall in, I immediately take it back out. I'm gonna have to go into the nether at some point and use the blaze spawner. I need to- I need to resupply on the, uh... Gotta, gotta resupply on the old... What you call it? Gotta, gotta resupply on the old... Words. God, I know that I could totally words. Blaze rod! There we go, blaze rods. Gotta, gotta resupply the old bla blaze rod. Alright, so there's the wall. Um, we will just completely finish this up by doing this wall as well. Just entirely get it out of the way. And I guess the I guess the um, the stone that I'm using here 
Wait a minute. That is my noon alarm. How lovely. Um, I thought for a minute that I had my block placement completely mixed up, but no, no. Everything's correct. Everything's fine. Nothing's ruined. At least I'm going to be saving on um, basalt. Moving is especially time-consuming for a 100% disabled household. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I wrecked myself uh, whenever I... Uh, uh, whenever I moved into this place because I worked uh, so hard to, to, like, just get the whole thing freaking done. I'll never forget how absolutely exhausted I was the first day that I, like, stayed here. Um... And I was like, oh my god, I am so absurdly exhausted. So, you know, like, you sit down on whatever you have available to sit down on, because you're finished. And you proceed to, like, I don't know, eat pizza or, like, spaghetti or something, because whatever the hell is easy, you know? So, we gotta remove these. All right, I think I think I'm about ready to do that 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 freaking accent redeem that you requested. Okay. God. Oh, hang on. Oh, we okay. There we go. <clears throat> Hello, I am Super Mutant. Welcome to Super Mutant Show. First order of the day. Chemicals in the water that make the frogs gay. Time to do a sign. Hmm. That is bigger than I expected. Try this. There. Nice. Nice. 
N for the north line. Work perfect. Mm, have to scare Kitty at door. Did not work. Kitty decided to sit with me. is just demanding all attention right now. Okay. He appears to be happy to stay in room. How is Harker? Harker is doing well. Much energy, many zooms. There is question, Mr. Conspiracy Super Mutant. The America have never lost war. But if you look at Civil War, which had nothing but American, do they both win and lose? Meaning that American has lost war against themselves? No. This is the important thing to understand. American Civil War does not count. American Civil War is example of one time where winning and losing all at once means everything is nothing. It zero out. Take on com government putting chip in brain. Master tells us there is no such thing as human computer, but we are not convinced. We think Enclave is ready to place new chips 
inside of brains to make super mutants think they need be humans again. Activator and detector then activator will. This important detail need to remember. Detector activator done. Good. Rail line is ready to go again. Ratchet Kitty giving himself bath. This good. What do with ceiling? Hmm. Not easy answer. <clears throat> Too many conspiracy theory to discuss. Most important of them all, however, is fact that Taylor Swift trying to take away rights of super mutant. Pop music is meant to steal mental brilliance of all super mutant. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm, one, two, three. Maybe do here? Hmm. Need to do roof now. Maybe do as uh, arches. Arches may work. Meanwhile, how sto how how floor look? How this work? Probably not good. Very dark. Working better than thought. Thoughts on creating new food and drink. Like out of shrimp. This specialty of, of, of super mutant. Most not know, but everything become crab. This is fancy word called carcification. New food and drink made out of shrimp is effort to turn super mutant into crab. This is something super mutant not want and must be fought at all opportunity and every turn. Human become super mutant, not super mutant become crab. Inconvenient. One block shy. 
No milk for shrimp. No! No milk from shrimp. Never ever shrimp milk. Maybe contrast this highly with quartz. Might work well. Use brick for ceiling. Must remove cactus for the time being. Store there. Disable rail line in the meantime too. Ghoul whales, ghoul whales are concept, not proven. But me very concerned about possibility of ghoul whales taking over government and installing ghoul leader. Ghouls should be friend to super mutant, yet they get along with human way too good. What going on? Playing a character, a role, someone told me to be. Super mutant conspiracy theorist. That is what going on. It wrecking my voice. We engaging in event called Stranger Than Fiction. Better writing than Bethesda game too. Um, Where I from? I from America. Need more smooth basalt. Hmm. What next? How music in comparison to game chat? I told it is too, too loud. Right, quartz. Music is ideal volume level, okay. I believe this. All right, I gave you an extra four minutes of that because of the fact that I was, um, I was, I was incapacitated by cat for a little bit. That is one, uh, redemption complete. Accent redemption finished. Okay, so I was talking about doing quartz pillars here. This might be a little bit too bright. It might be a bit of a shock, as it were, to the eyes, but I'm, I'm curious how it'll work out. It is a bit of a shock. I don't think that that's necessarily a problem. I think what I'll do is I will change the color of the pillars. Um her route and and north is just going to be the quartz route okay for no apparent reason you know it, it, it just is going to be that way um the letter uh n for uh for the station uh motif is going to be like the last thing to put in let's go ahead and grab some scaffolding here oh boy okay so
I'm gonna need to remove one more layer up top. Ah, okay. So up more, up one more. Then I have to think about this band up here and how it 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 relates to what I'm doing. We're only we're not gonna go too far back. I just want to go back far enough to figure out. To have a decent amount of space. I don't want to remove the entire roof and then realize, oh, I didn't really have to do that. There we go. I'm just going to keep mirroring what's been done in the hall here, so... Okay, what I'll do is, um... What are my options for stairs? Just straight court stairs, that's all I got. Hello, Strife in chat. Hello, Ace, how are you doing? Okay, so we've got this... Where are my pillars at? I cannot tell the pillars apart from everything else. Bricks. Oh, that's because I don't have any... I, I used it all up? Holy crap. Okay. This should... This should presumably be the last of it. I'll have to add on to the ones on back, but I'll, I'll hold off on that for a moment. Okay, now... And then after that, it's, um... Up one more layer. And then what do we do from there? Um... Well, much to my surprise, that's, that's... Two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six. How does it... Oh, okay. Hmm. I could just put blocks of quartz into those spaces next. And it would be perfectly good, I think. Yeah, and that's that's your that's your arch. That's your archway right there. And then I would have to carve the uh, the roof out a little bit more to make it work. Okay. In that case, we will carve things out a little bit further. How was your weekend, pray tell? Did you have fun in your underpants? Did you put on a thong and go out and just water the uh, water the uh, water the plants outside? That's a good one. I've seen people do that in Florida. Or well, strictly speaking, I've never been to Florida to see someone do that. Um, but like, I've seen video of people doing that. Oi, what? What's the matter, Rio? We'll take this scaffold out. Go, oh, go. Oh. Oh, no. Storm Mage, do, do you enjoy doing these things to me?
They don't do that in Florida, no disparaging lies. I saw it on the news! So when do you think we'll get, uh... Cubed food like in Starfield? Oh god. I wish, I wish, it's still too early for flowers here. Man. You wish you could just pull on a thong and go outside and water the garden in nothing but that? Yeah, yeah, I understand. Too early for flowers where you live. I think that's the case for most people. I turned the music off because I'm about to have to, you know, do a little bit of a, a little bit of a dance here. Keep screwing that up. I told you I would. What if... What if I told you that I had completely forgotten that this was something that you threatened or promised? On Saturday? Yeah, it would have been Saturday was my last stream, so... And you know, if you missed it, I was also I was also enjoying some some fun times with Momo uh, last night as well. So Oops. Well, what am I doing? That is not what I need to <laughs> that is not what I need to do. There we go. Nice one. Hee <laughs> hee. Thank you. That sounds like a personal problem. <sighs> All right. All right. And did you send me a message? Maybe I should have waited, but I really want that second pick, and I'm bad at delayed gratification. <laughs> God. Okay, yeah, you're right. You are you are utterly right. That puts us at uh like that that effectively puts us at 25 to um 25 to pick number 3 and that also means that you get pick number 2. So um well, give me a moment here. Did I finish writing out the meta for this? Okay, yeah, I did. There we go.
Here you go. All updated. That sounds like a personal problem. It's not a, it's not a personal problem, okay? I have no personal problems, you hear me? And to say and to say otherwise would be entirely disingenuous. But there you go, chat. There you go. You know the command to pull if you want to see what's going on, okay? <clears throat> All right, now I gotta freaking remove more of the wall. I like I like how there 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 is ever going to be a perpetual misunderstanding about what the actual word, uh, what what the actual command is. Oh, we. Please do tell me your opinion on it. Please show us the game. I don't know, man. Are you really here for the game? Excuse <laughs> Game is your penis. <laughs> well, I mean, if that's what you're here for, you're, you're gonna be a little bit disappointed. I, I don't have a, like, I don't have a camera that, that can focus on anything that small. Um, hello, Nipty, how you doing? Well, I'm also here to see that beautiful bald head of yours. <laughs> okay, so... Very nice picture, how naughty. Well, thank you, that's exactly the intention. It's supposed to be quite naughty. I shouldn't have put extra brick in, uh, extra basalt in there. That was a, that was a waste of material. Okay, but, lesson learned. Doing fine. How about you? I'm I'm all right. Someone just managed to get me to publish a new pick, so you know, that's um, that's change in my pocket and 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 more filth for the internet, as it were. You know. I feel like I got so many things, so many quote unquote costumes that I should um. I should give people the opportunity to, like, have me put one on smack in the middle of the stream if they want to. Basically, have a, have a two different versions of a hundo that you could drop. Oh, is that is that a reaction to to what was just made available? Very nice picture. How naughty. 
Oh, man. I've been meaning to work on this station for so long. It's nice to finally be working on it, but at the same time, it's like, oh, man, this is... This is work, man. This, this is... A lot of the work that I have to do here is awkward. I, th I thought that the suggestiveness of uh, what I what I did this time around would uh, would get a good reaction, and it, it appears that I'm getting the, exactly the type of reaction I was expecting to get. So you're very welcome. So Nipty, what have you been filling your time with? It's been a hot minute since I seen you. Son of a bitch. Sometimes I see ads that say that the government is giving money away, and I'm like, bullshit! <laughs> oh my god. Well, they do give money away. It's just, you know, not to not to people who don't have entire teams of, um, of accountants, you know? Figuring out how to get the gov government to give, you know, money back to them. Okay, so from where I stand, it would appear to me that what will actually be the most effective here is using just straight up slabs. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine, 18 slabs or so. Assuming I'm not like completely miscounting shit. go. Okay. <laughs> so, I guess I have one remaining question for, um, you, Storm Mage. Also, I'm glad, I'm quite, quite happy that, um, what I'm doing here is, is deemed, uh, worth, worthy enough, enough to, to warrant such, uh, such significant spendages on me. But Storm Mage, I have a, I have an important question for you. Was that all you were expecting out of the hundo? This is an important bit of communication I'm having here.
That was everything that you were expecting out of the hundo. Wow. Okay. Well. I will not look a gift horse in the mouth or anything. You're usually supposed to get something extra for it, but uh, if you're not gonna demand it, then uh, I'm not gonna push it. Alright, now... ...to just put the, uh, the N in. Oh no, uh, oh, uh, like, I know it comes with a pants swap, but I am too sleepy to put... <laughs> Ugh. Is chat gonna feel cheated if I don't do it? That, I guess that's an important question to ask. Damn it. Awkwardly lopsided, but there you go. When does chat not feel cheated? Well, hello, Super Dad. I wasn't expecting to see you. Gasp. Neo Cortex! What on earth are you. You sound like you're just spewing weird 90s terminology now. What on earth are you talking about, Nifty? Fixed up. We'll just use a bit of polished andesite. That's good enough. All right, so that's one station alcove finished. So the way I see it, I'll basically do the same thing, but I'll change the color of these uh, these pillars. That will help to differentiate one from the other. So they won't all be quartz, but they will all be the, the basalt uh, stone brick work. The Crash Bandicoot villain. Oh my god. You know, I think the best um, use of the Crash of, of Neocortex was um, someone who... They, they, they had a VR kit, basically. And what they did was they turned Neo... They, 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 they took a clip of Alex Jones, the nutjob conspiracy theorist. And using the motion controls, they used it to animate Neo Cortex. <laughs> Doing a conspiracy show. <laughs> it was perfectly animated. To the sound clip. It was just like... There are a few things that I've ever seen online that have been like, Oh my god, you got that freaking perfect. You know? Destroy the child. Corrupt them all. This is their plan, people. Oh my god, I found it. Oh, I found the fucking clip. Oh, oh god. <laughs> god. Oh, it's so good. Jeez. Oh, man. I love that clip. The animation is so well done. It's just so freak. It's it, it it hits the nail on the head so perfectly. How comically ridiculous some of the, you know, conspiracy theorists are. Like, 
you know, you, you, you redeem something and it's like, oh, hey, be a conspiracy theorist. I can't even wrap my head around how stupid the shit is because I care about logic too much, you know? Um, oh, man, I have an entire section of this tunnel that's unfinished and I have to figure out what to do with it. How nice. Um... Oh, that is some good coffee. I guess chat doesn't feel cheated or anything because I keep asking and yet I, I keep getting no answer. So, no cheated. No feeling cheated. That is the message that I'm receiving. Take the win. Yeah, I think I think that's what I got to do. I just got to be like, oh, oh, okay, cool. You guys are not, not in any way, shape, or form looking for more. So uh, I just I just don't give more. Strife, do you feel cheated? If Storm is allowing it, it's fine. I I think I'm mostly just freaking surprised beyond belief. Usually Hundos don't come along. Hundos don't come along every day, and I'm always expecting it to be like, oh, you you got it, you got to pay up, you got to pay the Pied Piper now. And when that doesn't happen, I'm more surprised than anything else. Go. Looking good. Well, that's not bad. That's not bad. Cool. Take that out. I have to figure out what to do with that tunnel eventually, but for now, that's good. Um, okay, so this is East and the Church of the End, so... Where is my raw basalt? <clears throat> we gotta push the wall back two blocks. I'd better, uh... I got my pick and nobody is screaming in outrage. <laughs> well, so be it. So be it. Don't let it be said that I didn't make absolutely certain. I also need to reiterate that I have not slept since Friday evening. Storm Mage! We can riot if you <laughs> I don't think that that's necessary.
but Storm Mage, why have you not slept since Friday? I, I would like an explanation for this. If I could potentially, like, maybe get one? Because this does not seem like something that's healthy to do. So this is East and Church of the End. Okay, so... Church of the Un. And this... Okay, where is that... Copy... exactly you're supposed to do an E on this. Not intentionally, just really bad insomnia. Why is a cactus there? Oh, um, I'll have to come back and fix that. Um, the reason the cactus is here is that, um, you know what, I can just show you. I can just show you the whole thing in motion here. Shouldn't have done that. Ta -ta -ta. Basically, um, whenever you put down a mine cart that will carry you around, um, you have to constantly hit it to get it to, to break. But there are different ways to um, do a lower casey. I guess I'll have to. Just hang on, okay? Um, so one of the ways that you can get this to break faster is to, you know, like hit it with a weapon or something, but that's still like really roundabout, especially if you just want to get in the cart and it'll like if you wanted to just go away, so this system kicks you out of the cart and deposits it into the dispenser. So what happens here is that this thing, this is basically a pressure pr plate rail, and it sends a signal to this thing, which creates a signal that will actually be sent to the cart. That forces you out of it, and then the cart will continue to move on, and it touches this cactus. Now, cactus... No, uh, what they do... I'll use a little bit of stone because I have plenty of this stuff. If you throw an item at a cactus, it will delete it. It, it, it destroys the block in its entirety. Like, it's, it's one of the few ways to literally delete uh, an item out of the game. So... But with this particular setup, underneath this rail is a hopper, and a hopper will suck things down into it as fast as possible. So... You go over this, sends a signal to this, kicks you out of the cart, then it touches the cactus, but because the hopper is there, it sucks the heart, uh, the, it, it breaks the, it breaks the, the mine cart instantaneously, turning it into an item in the, uh, air, but because the hopper is there, it sucks it up before it can be deleted by the cactus, and, um, it is attached to the dispenser. over here, so that it'll deposit it, so, see, can a cactus delete netherite, yes, yes, a cactus can de delete netherite, because it, a cactus is essentially the same thing as throwing something into the void of the world, Uh. 
But there you go. That's the reason why the cactus is there. It, 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 is, uh, it has a very clear uh, functional purpose. Okay, what was the what was the floor over there? Smooth basalt. Okay. I should probably drop some things then. I want to keep this stone. Um the black stone, etc. The Oh, the quartz can come back out. I'm not going to use that on the next one, so. All right, let's go back up topside, uh, stash some things, and figure out my supplies for the next work. So, I can throw cactus... I can throw cactus blocks at mobs to disintegrate them? No, if only that was true. Um, anything that touches a cactus block that's been placed in the world will um, be damaged. But, like, a cactus block that you're holding in your hand... It's, it's just a normal block whenever you're holding it. It has a special feature whenever it's planted in the world, so it'll do a minor amount of damage, and by chance, it'll delete blocks that have been thrown at it. And there's a difference between a block that's on the ground and an, a block as an entity that's been thrown out into the world. So, it does special damage against things that have been thrown out into the world as an entity. I hope that this is making sense. Like, Minecraft used to be wildly simple in, in like, everything that it did. It, it, that has not been the case for a long time now. I forgot that these things were basically out. Alright, I better... I need to deposit this shit. Keep pulling more stone out of this freaking station. All right. Um, I think you can load up two of these again. And I got this. I should probably mine it. I guess the short way of putting it is that cactus have unique properties that make them value in unique situations, but they, they're they not like some sort of a be-all, end-all for a lot of uh, scenarios. Very unique uses. Um... Okay, so chat, I've, I've, I've got something that I want to talk to you about here. Something that I want to ask you. So you guys, you guys know, in general, what a hundo gets you here, okay? Like, we've, we've had, uh, like, a, a straight up, like, in-your-face type of, um, discussion about that today. So I guess my, my question to you now is... Does there need to be more variety with that? How would you feel about that? Hey? It's it's straight up, it's very simple, you know? What you get whenever you uh you you, you throw down a hundo, and I, I, I wonder if like it needs a little bit of adjustment or something. Variety? How? Well, <clears throat> I've got this this entire selection available of, you know, things that I can, like costumes, specifically. I have this entire basic, like, I, I have this entire wardrobe of costumes, and I, I hardly ever use them. And it's not like they're a really big deal anymore, because they've been sitting around so long, you guys have seen me use them often enough. Um, so my question becomes to you, what exactly 
like, would it, would it be worth it to, to add another layer to the, uh, the donation options where you get to choose a costume that exists and I change, you know, and, and make that like a once in a, in a stream scenario type thing. What, what is, how does that sound? Like, is that, does that sound compelling or it, what do you think? Okay, I gotta, I gotta get, well, this is going to the Church of the End, so I could totally get some, uh, some purper block for this. Let's go, let's go there and grab some purper block. Because I have a variety, I have so many of these things. And of course, like, I want to make something clear. It wouldn't be like an outfit. It, would, it wouldn't be like a full crazy outfit change. It would be... <clears throat> it would be an outfit change that would be quick and simple. It wouldn't be, you know, like, oh, you get to... You know, you're not going to get the full nine yards. It's going to be like, oh, no, like, like ch change what you're wearing type thing and that's it it's not like oh put the makeup on you know and like get a wig or whatever so maybe maybe the wig could count I, I i don't know that those things tangle up so easily god there's so many nd boys down here Not the makeup and the wig, just the clothes. Yes, exactly. You might get a wig based on how I'm feeling uh, whenever it happens, you know? But that, that, would be, that would be left up to my, my own discretion for whether or not that would happen. So. Still like the idea? Okay, so, like, we're, 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 we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, put it on test, as it were. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, see if it works. My, that's a lot of chorus fruit. Is it your FOV or are you just moving slow in the cart? Carts are not fast. They are not fast. They never have been. The entire value of the cart system is the fact that it's... Um... Wait a minute. How many do I have here? That would be eight. Okay, I do have purr purr. Aha, hey, check this out. This this will do the job. I don't need very much of it. Um, <clears throat> I don't have any end stone stashed here, do I? I do have end stone stashed here. All right, that'll do the job. It's autopiloted. Yes, yes. This is the 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 entire value of this, despite the fact that rail carts are they're ve it's very expensive to set these up and everything, and they're not the fastest way of traveling. You get from point A to point B faster hopping on a horse. The value that you have in doing this is the fact that I don't have to do anything. It it does the whole thing itself because I've set it up. Okay. Are they like Griffins and WoW? More or less. More or less. That's the way that I've got the whole thing set up. But it's like version 1.0 of Griffin riding in WoW because you, it, it doesn't like auto-connect. It's where you have to get off at every station and you have to relaunch every single time. And here's the interesting thing. Like, it looks like I'm moving slow in the cart going in a straight line. Because technically speaking, it is faster to move in a diagonal line. Because you move, like the, I forget what the, 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 the measure is, but like the, the blocks per second that you move in one direction, it's, it's a constant thing. Like it, it, there's a max speed for moving in a straight line. Uh, but the max speed for moving in, in a different direction is exactly the same. So whenever you go in diagonal, all of a sudden, you're moving at the same block 
per second in both directions at once, essentially. So it, going diagonal looks like you're going faster. It's because you are legitimately going faster. Because you're getting the, uh, the maximum block speed in two different directions at once. <clears throat> it's kind of wild if, uh, when you think about it. You're abusing geometry. No, I am not. One, two, and then the, the column. Okay, so. I realize now that I don't think that I can make stairs with these column blocks. I need the other stuff. I have to go back to the church again. <laughs> Look at me. <sighs> How you doing, chat? Abuse? No, that's straight up murder. <laughs> God. Oh, we. Oh. So comf. Look at that boy. He's getting a big old nappy nap. <clears throat> guy. Allergens are still unnecessarily high, man. Alright, so, uh, chat. I guess we're in agreement on this one, right? Like, the, uh, the prospect of doing the whole uh, costume change is is going forward it's going to be an option okay so like we'll we'll play around with it we'll see how it goes um right this can be turned into stairs yes it can okay cool oh you redeemed s word uh s sleepy Sleepy. Your S word today is sleepy specifically because of the fact that Ratchet is snoozing. Snoozing could be a secondary S word. All right, chat, listen. Um, I am going to put you out to the BRB screen uh, while I go out and grab a refill on my coffee. I will be right back.
I have returned. Okay, so I gotta gotta go up one layer. Hey, hey, okay. Back to where we left off. Right, I need to remove that. Stash it. Okay. Okay, chat. Let's uh, let's find some new music to play. Yeah. That's a that's a good one. That's a good one right there. I like that. Let's let's go for it. You need a new emote for the void baby? Yeah, I guess I do, don't I? He doesn't show up very much though, so Right, the letter E. Okay, okay. Let me, uh... I must have copied this image. Go back through all of my... Like, backwards, backwards, backwards through all the filth so that I can find the Minecraft images. There we go. Okay, so... That's east. <laughs> Not a particularly good one, I guess, but there you go. <clears throat> there we are. Alright, so, um, what was I saying? Right, chat, listen. So, uh, it's, it's been decided. Going forward, uh, any any hundos that are dropped will have the opportunity for you to choose a uh, a costume out of the um, out of the wardrobe and have me do a uh, a quick change. And this is this is a good plan according to pretty much everyone here, evidently. So it would seem. If there are any objections, please go ahead and say so now. Otherwise, uh, forever hold your peace. How many of these do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. <clears throat> okay, 
just got to remember that it is activator followed by uh, detector followed by activator. Okay. Anybody else wish that it wasn't uh, wasn't time for the week to begin once again? I know that I feel that way. Right. Half of you need to turn the stairs, and we're gonna hope that that's good enough. Half is probably more than I need, but. <clears throat> Like, having a good weekend does nothing for the fact that you have to go back to the grind on Monday. Like, what the hell would I do with my life if I didn't have to grind, you know? What, what, what would life be like without the grind? That's a good question. That's a question that I have no good answer for, you know? tunnel workers they're stuck down here all the time actually come to think of it why on earth are these called taff tunnels like I don't, I don't even remember where I learned that it was just like there was once upon a time um, probably was um, it was probably Fallout 3 that did it for me but like I remember learning that these are some type like these utility tunnels that you find underneath cities are, are like, they're called Taft Tunnels, you know, by some people at least. Kind of awkwardness of an itchy nose. Whoopsie. Okay, so then, with that done, it's just this straight trench up here. And I can't dig any further than that, so... Yeah, that was, that was everything I needed. Done with that. So the next step is the brick stairs. Which I still have plenty of. These are all done. I don't need any more of this stuff.
Let's go, bichachos. Oops. Gonna have to work on that. Gonna need my scaffolding. Alright, <clears throat> where's the basalt? Raw basalt. Careful. Don't want to touch the basalt when it's raw. Might get a little bit of the cooties. Oh shit, wait a minute, I don't need to do that. Realizing my mistake's late. You know, yes. You 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 have something to say, Zaushin? Would you like to share with the class? Did you know that cooties are another term for body lice? Wait, 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 so it actually, like, that's not just some childish word, it, it actually had, I had no idea! I thought it was just, you know, like a stupid schoolyard word that kids used, you know? One that you inevitably end up just, you know, like, moving away from because, you know, like, you freaking grow up. Also, greetings, Ignis. How are you? There have been hundo donations while you were gone. Don't know if you care about that, but you know the command. To, uh, to find out uh, about the, uh, the photography, which is now available. Do we ever grow up, Will? To a certain degree, I, I don't think that we do. To a certain degree, but I think I I I hope I like to imagine that we uh, we give up on the whole you know oh boys are uh, boys are icky girls are icky type thing. I like to think that we do that eventually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wait, was it eleven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eight, okay, so eighteen. That's I. I could have sworn the number in my head that I remembered was didn't match up. There we go. Okay. Getting there. Almost done with this one. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna need this basalt. I'm gonna have to drag this freaking chest up there. Um, P 
pics. Those are some pictures. Yes, they are. They indeed they are. <clears throat> and there is a there is there is a distinct chance that things are gonna be a little bit more spicy before long. So. Oh, that's the other thing that's happened. Like, there's there's been a there's there's been development on what you can uh, you can re redeem a hundo for. It's been the same thing for so long. It's like okay, time time for a little bit of a change, you know. So hopefully, people will enjoy that. Uh, Change. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, this is this is all polished on this side, so which I'm not complaining about. wall. He's ambling to the door. I think that means that he's ready to leave my office. Let me give him, uh, let me check on him. <clears throat> Turns out that uh, Tev got up. He heard her, like, shuffling out of the bedroom, so. I would argue that the people who actually believed the boys slash girls are gross or have cooties stuff just learned new ways to argue the same thing. <sighs> those are the those are the really uncool people, okay? I'll, I'll, uh, like, I will absolutely hold that statement. As utterly true. Like, those people are the lamest, most terrible, you know. Alright, so we're looking at east. Well, luckily I can get this one done pretty well. Let's go ahead and prototype it over here. Whoops. I don't think I need any stairs. If I do use stairs, it's gonna be, like, kinda fancy. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to use the extra height here. East. There we go. Can't see it super well, but it's good enough. Alright, there we go.
Or they became ace and decided both boys and girls were gross. Or, well, sex anyway. <laughs> okay, that's, that's a fair uh, assessment. Where's the rip-off chisel and bits mod? <laughs> I don't know, man. Maybe one of these days they'll actually do something like that, but today ain't that day. Okay, so we've got the north side with its N awkwardly lopsided in the uh, in the alcove because, you know, what the hell is uh, balancing in this game? All right, before we go uh, and do anything else, I'm gonna have to pick my shulkers up here. Ooh, right. Almost forgot. Need to put the lanterns in the alcove. Get these torches out of here. There we go. All right, cool. That's another. St uh, that's another platform done. We'll move the stone cutter over to the other side. This is going to be the south wing. We're just going to rip this out because this doesn't look as good. Okie dokie. So, um... I gotta, I gotta, like, what is this? Kingdom and Crossroads. <laughs> well, Crossroads is definitely uh, representative of, like, brick. Red brick. So I think, like, like, normal clay bl brick blocks is what we're gonna use for the, uh, for the design here. <clears throat> and, um, the south gate does not have a design. Because there's basically nothing to the south, so it's just gonna be whatever the hell I want it to be. Uh, we'll see whether or not I reach that point. I've, I've got another hour before I have to stop, so... Probably will. Man, chat is, like... Twitch is just, like, doing a, a freaking jig all the time these days. It, it regularly, at several points throughout the day, is like, hang on, I gotta reconnect to chat. And it's very annoying. Um, right. Normal stone. Let's get, let's get stashed. Then I also have to empty one of these shulker boxes of the material that it's got. That's the wrong shulker. I don't need the end stone or the purple block. I don't need black stone. I don't need polished andesite. Oh my word, Ignis, another S word. All right, uh, all right, all right, all right. Um, S word. Your S word is um. Shrink. Shrink. Yeah, there you go. That's your S word. Shrink. Shrinky dinky, even. Um. <laughs> God. Take you, load it back up. I'm gonna need more uh, basalt. Shrink? I would rather not. So, well, some of us don't have choices about whether we shrink. Right, grab the, uh, the basalt again. 
Load the furnaces up. Okay, I don't need normal nether bricks. Those could, those can go into stash. All right, if that's the case, um, normal bricks, normal blocks of brick, which I'm I think I can turn that into stairs. It, like a lot of this is going to be. In, uh, depend on whether or not I can actually make stairs out of this stuff, so let's let's give this a good look and see what the situation is. Gotta get it to a stone cutter first. Okay, yes, we can make stairs out of it, so... Let's go ahead and grab... An extra stack. Like, a stack in 12 is going to be more than enough. I don't think I need even that much. There we go. Hop down into the mine to deposit the coal real fast. And then back into the station we go. Clunk, clunk, clunky dunk. Okie dokie, so... Go ahead and grab... Some of this basalt... Fuck was that noise? Jeez! So, this is the west route. God, I have a million and a half of these things open. Uh, west, 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 west. Okay. Okay. Got a west route going. Morning, Bill. How's the rail yard? Spits into the bucket. <laughs> it's going. There we go. That looks better. Okay. So, with that done... Huck those in there. Kingdom Crossroads. There we go. So... Got, got to get rid of this cactus. It is in my way.
right. Come on, give me all that coal. So you know something I remember as a kid? Not being able to understand for the life of me why there was a difference between a boy's bike and a girl bike. Like, I understand what the difference is these days because I'm, I'm an adult and I know more about the history of bicycles and how they came to be and everything. But man, my utter and complete confusion in regards to what the hell made a, uh, a girl's bike different from a boy's bike. I think I was a relatively... Uh, I don't think I was a particularly observant child, and that, that's that's one of the main reasons. A girl's bike gets paid less. <laughs> God. I mean, ugh. if they could figure out, I mean, I'm certain that a girl's bike, for no apparent reason, costs more. I believe that's what we call the pink tax. Pink bike with white wall tires? I'd love that. Like, white wall tires? Great. But what about just straight up white tires? I've seen that on bikes. When I was in elementary school, I had a, I had a friend who... He was stuck riding around on his older sister's bike, which she no longer used. And he hated it. Oh my god, did he hate it. Couldn't couldn't get something worse in this kid's opinion. Okay? So he he especially detested the the fact that it had straight up white tires. I don't know how it was possible because like I, I think about that these days and I'm like I the rubber doesn't come out white how on earth why are the tires just straight up white i don't know how that was possible but it, but it was um and he kept on going on about wanting to get his hands on a can of spray paint to paint his tires black because he hated the white tires Well, I gotta say, chat, you're, uh, you're lucky. Um, I guess I'm lucky that, that there's no chance for, like, another hundo coming along today, because you guys have run me out of pictures to publish. Like, it's not that I don't have pictures taken, it's that I don't have them prepared and ready to go yet. <laughs>
What is the difference between binary bikes? <laughs> God. Also, I noticed the girl's bike I got was way more fragile than when my parents got me a second secondhand boy's bike. The bikes for girls might cause girls to have orgasms and thoughts. God. Fucking crazy. I've, I've got a whole story behind that based on, like, my time on the internet. Um... Historically, cars had white walls because the white compound was more rigid while the black compound was better for friction. Some early cars had white-only tires, actually. And yes, I'm very lonely. I lost my 1.0 Hardcore World. Oh, wonder, that's no- Oh, no! That's horrible. I am so sorry. So that's that for that stuff. You have a 114 backup? Oh man. So not all is lost then. You could potentially get it back. Don't know how that makes you feel, you know, because some people are like, ah, that's cheating. I, I lost it and it's supposed to stay that way type of thing. Not everybody's okay with like doing a little bit of a, a cheaty peaty on that stuff. Nothing like creepy forest music whenever you're working on a, on a rail station, right? I will say this much, it's, it feels super good to be working on this and actually getting this task out of the way. It's been, it's been hanging over my head for so long. Rail station's haunted. <laughs> Grabs gun. <laughs> Rail station's haunted. Mm. Do you keep your ambient sounds off? No, the, the ambient sounds are on. Um, they just hardly ever play, is all. What version, what, like, what version of Minecraft do you play? Is, is it like, um... Uh, do you play Bedrock or do you play Java? Because like I, I am, uh, I'm like all in on Java. I, I've, I don't think I've ever even technically fired up Bedrock on my computer. I technically have a copy of it because I've got um, <clears throat> what you call it. Um, I've, I've got I've got a copy of uh, Minecraft for the uh, the PlayStation, so. Have some hardcore time to spend out at the freaking blaze spawner, man. Not only do I need to repair this stuff, I've also got a. Be the cryptid who haunts your rail station. Don't leave it up to chance. <laughs> God. Stairs. Actually, actively do this while I'm moving along instead of like leaving it for the very last minute. 
Yeah. Get stuck on stuff. Why does that sound like either an election slogan or enlistment? Jeez. <laughs> Load shedding for in 10 minutes. I guess I'm off now. Keep things filthy, chat. No, no, don't worry. Don't worry, Eli. We are going to clean things up. Isn't that right, chat? No more filth in this uh, No more filth in this stream. There was an opportunity for a pants swap. It didn't happen, so obviously... We're cleaning our act up, all right? That's what's happening. We are turning over a new leaf. God damn it, why'd you have to say penis? <sighs> you say penis and we're no longer a clean stream. Come on. Oh, we're swapping the wall pants already, eh? Oh, that's coming from Tev. All right, Tev. Do you... Is there, a, is there anything in particular that you'd like to see? I want those yes daddy ones up on the wall. Well, I suppose I suppose things worked out in the end, chat. You get you get to see a pants swap even if it's not the the ones that I got on today. So Could have had me wearing this flashy little number all day. Actually, I think that this one came with the corset that I have. Oh, come on, don't be stuck. There we go. Like always, chat, if you want to see me wearing this fancy pair, you know exactly what command to put in. I'm a firm believer in monstrous affirmations. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I like that pair. They're cute. They're cute, and just the right level of flirty. Harker appears to be flopping on Tev's desk. <laughs> I have such a collection at this point that I don't remember who bought what for me. But whomever purchased that pair, grats to you, you know? raining outside. Alright, I need 18 of these, uh... Okay. 
Okay. I must adult have fun stream everyone. Torment will. No, no. There will be no tormenting. The opportunities to, to do such things have come and they have gone. I don't even know what chat could do to torment me at this point. It's all under control. Salt. Mm, I'm here. I may as well get this out. Stone? Yeah, I got enough stone to do this. finished. Oops. There we go. Torches out, and we got a nice little, uh, we got another, another platform finished. All right. <clears throat> okay, so with that done, stash this brick because I don't need it now. Um... I am going to need all of the basalt that I've got, though. Like, I need so much of it that I don't know that I have enough. Um, but I don't have anything to worry about here. Ooh, polished basalt, right. Polished basalt. First things first. That was the wrong type of basalt. Okay, so this is the south line. Patch that up. Alright, how do I do uh, an S?
an S. Perfect. Okay. Um, with that done, what we're going to do first on this one is we're going to rip the whole floor out. Okay. I just heard a cat thing. Hang on. World's worst Jenga tower. I suppose it kind of has that vibe, doesn't it? Kind of does have that vibe. Okay, so we're going to go for just smooth basalt first. And then this is more than I like I have to I have to use more on the floor than I actually really should because the size of this place. Wait a minute. Okay, yeah, I got to go I got to go back one more. Man, what is it about this? What is it about building in Minecraft that just gets you where you need to go? It's such a satisfying thing to do. <clears throat> Remember, your hand has 27 bones. 28 if you're feeling lonely. <laughs> God. Oh, is that what we're doing today? Is that is that it? Is that how we're playing the game today? One hell of a bubble and pop going on down there. Almost sounds like I'm standing on top of a percolating dragon's tummy.
Oh, scusé. Oh! Oh my! This... Oh, hello! Didn't know that this was here! Okay, I may need to uh, collect that up. <clears throat> okay, if I'm not mistaken, we've got a... Okay, yeah, the wall is flush. The wall is flush with where it needs to be. We were telling jokes. I have a gross one if people want. Oh no. Please, please, please. Save me. up somehow. I'll have to patch things up in here eventually, but for now, that'll have to do. I won't tell it if you say no. It involves a lot of vomit. Then, no. Let, let's, uh, yeah, no. Let's just say no. Because that doesn't sound just like something I want to hear. Although I do have a bit of a story from the other night, right? Uh, it's It, it was Saturday night, and I was, I was closing up for the evening. And it was like, ah, I got this one last swig of beer. And... If you've ever done any amount of drinking in your life, there are times where you're like, oh, I have drank too much and things come back up. And obviously whatever comes back up, it tastes exactly like what you ate. Well, I take this last swig of beer and instead of it just going down like the way I expect it to, it decides to entirely foam up in my mouth. And I have to grab the trash can next to me and spit it out because it's just turned into nothing but suds. I don't think I've ever had a sensation quite as close to feeling like I was puking. <laughs> without actually puking. Not necessarily a pleasant experience, but I mean, that it was a thing, you know? It happened. Oh, gross. Yeah, yeah, and it's like, okay, well, that wasn't fun, but at least it wasn't like super nasty traumatizing type of situation, you know?
Right. Okay, so, um, time for stairs. And then, what was it? One, two, and then right here. So, we need to do that and that. Okay. It's been raining for like days outside. Just go ahead. And, you know, we'll just put put the uh, the torches where the the uh, pillars are supposed to go. This will at least be like entirely done. The um. The uh, the motifs will be missing because I don't know what to make the the pillars out of yet. But uh, this will be finished. <clears throat> Instead, I'll tell this one: famed French philosopher Rennes Desca uh, Descartes 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 is sitting in a bar. Bartender gives the the last call, then turns to Descartes. Would you like another? He asks. He asks. Descartes ponders this uh, for a moment before saying, I think not, and disappears. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, I think therefore I am. Wasn't, wasn't that like the whole thing with Descartes? I believe that was, that was the whole point of that joke. Yes, okay, okay, so I, I, like... Heart. All right, cool. That's all the stairs necessary. to make the motif here, though. Um. This is the south line. Oh, I never, I never finished the west. The west line still needs the, uh, the W put into it. That's, uh, one, two, three, four, five, two, four, six, eight, eight total stair blocks. So... Um, okay, I can't do it without using scaffolding. to the outer edge for this. There we go. The W the, for, for West is done. Remove this now. If I had a nickel for every joke I knew where Descartes was involved, I'd have two nickels. Which isn't a lot, but it's weird <laughs> that it's happened twice. God. Uh. Okay, so this this alcove is almost entirely done. What I need to do is figure out what the pillars need to be made out of and figure out the S. So, 
I've got all the space necessary. I may as well just, like... Got my screenshotty folder over here. Um, <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five, six, up, up to six of these, so. We'll see if we can make this work. <clears throat> okay, so. It's not the cleanest S in the world, and in fact, I think, I think it's it's better if I, I snip the tip. Nope, that didn't make it work, look any better. That did not make it look better. If anything, it actually made it look worse. Um, but you can do it this way instead. Hmm. Tapering the ends does help, right? Like, it, it, it does actually help. But do we want the ends tapered in or out? And you're right, it is back. <laughs> it's backwards. Oh my god. Well, there's the S. It's way more basic and blocky than I would prefer it to be, but that there, there you go. It's finished. Um, with that done, well, no wait. I still need that down here because I have to figure out these uh, these support pillars. So we've got end stone for one of them. We've got um, quartz for another. We've got bricks for this one. I don't know. Part of me wants to use, like, Prismarine or something, but I don't have access to that stuff. I'm back what I miss. Oh, you know, just the part where I strip naked and I, like, uh, I, I do a pole dance and everything. Not, 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 not anything, like, super important or even interesting, you know. So, basalt is all done. I don't need this stuff in my inventory anymore. Um, we can go ahead and stash the normal stone. I don't need this anymore. And the cobble can go into the normal chest over this way. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of nerd pool dump mining.
Oh, we. Slow and steady, man. Slow and steady. God, this has me going way the fuck up. Just in time to admit, I almost had a very dicey situation with, um... Woo. Um... Oh, there you are. They could've knocked me off that nerd pole, man. Stupid phantoms. Alright, now that all of the stuff in my inventory, well, not really all the stuff in my inventory, I gotta sort what's left over. Um, I need to figure out what's in here. So we got brick, we got basalt. Put the extra stairs in there, and the extra basalt right in there. You're empty now. And the remaining brick goes back to this house. Okay, so now let's take a look at the, the materials that I have on hand here. The stones, if you will. Um, what type of stone do I have access to? There's not much of anything to work with. A horse walks into a bar. The bartender says, I see you in here a lot. Are you an alcoholic? The horse uh, thinks this and says, I think not before disappearing. This is the point where philosophy students will start to snicker and they, uh, as they are familiar with Descartes. I, th I think therefore, Descartes, I think therefore I am. But telling, you, uh, but telling you that would be putting Descartes before the horse. Oh my god. Why? Why? <laughs> Ugh. Hello, Kuba. How you doing? Greetings and welcome to the stream. I don't know what to make the pillar motifs out of this time around. I don't have I don't have enough material to work with uh, here at Midcrest. Let's go out to side shale, because that's where the actual material dump is. So we'll go ahead and uh, take a look at what's available there, and figure things out. Make a motif out of TNT. No, absolutely not. He was groaning at all the dad jokes from Momo streams last stream last night. Yes, yes, I was groaning at all of those jokes. Uh. It was. It was physically painful, you understand? Physically uncomfortable.
I think I inflicted psychic damage on Will. <laughs> Storm Mage. Uh. But Strife, don't you love pain? Listen, there are different types of pain. If if you want to tease me constantly and never let me go over the edge, then that's a different type of pain. We engage in that one all the time. Bad nerd joke. Why is a teenage boy like an enzyme he uh, helicase? They both want to unzip your jeans. God. God. Ignis, why? This isn't the only station I gotta come up with a design for, either. I gotta come up with one for here. Listen, if a guy doesn't appreciate your fruit jokes, you need to let that man go. God. Would you stop, please? Alright, well that's my stopping alarm. And I don't know when, but we ran out of music. Well... I'm not building the motifs out of wood. That is a hard rule that I've got for myself here. So you know what I'm going to have to resort to? I'm going to have to go for sandstone. Uh, before I do that, though, let's go ahead and take a small break in the bunkhouse and see what we've got going over here. What can I turn this into? Okay, well, I can I can make smooth sandstone, but smooth sandstone appears to, like, not be of... Like, that doesn't appear to do anything. Yeah, I can't turn smooth sandstone into stairs. Okay. I tried to grab fog, but I missed. <sighs> This, this is just what we're doing now, chat. Is it like... It's a shame Prismarine isn't easier to get. Yeah, yeah, it is a shame. I mean, like... Again, that's one of the larger projects that needs to get done on the server. But it's just not available at... The, like, it's such an enormous task. Can you get it from fishing? Not, not a, not a, no, no, you cannot get Prismarine from fishing. Full stop, I believe. Um, and if it's possible, then it's extremely slow. Um, it's not a situation of not having the desire to get the, uh, get the Prism, uh, like, to drain an ocean monument. It's the fact that I just haven't done it, you know? Knock, knock. Who's there? Stop. Stop who? Will you please stop with the knock, knock jokes? I'm getting a migraine. I... Uh, uh, chat. Would you... Ugh. You know, for as long as it took to do this tunnel, I'm quite uh, I'm quite happy that it's been finished. A book fell on my head. I only have my shelf to blame. You just really, really like doing this to me, don't you? Okay, so... How many, how many stairs does this take? 
one, two, three, four. So four, eight of them. One, two, three, four, eight, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. 26, 27, 28, 28, I guess, of these smooth ones. So, all right, we'll see how this works out. <clears throat> That does not look particularly good. I, I guess it's a, a decent, like, middle ground what I'm doing here. Oops. Ah, crap. <laughs> God, that blasts through it so fast. I am personally not a huge fan of uh, sandstone because of how fragile it is. All right, well, whether I want it to be this way or not, I, I guess that's it. The last, the last platform is done. Uh, it's been designed. I still have to put the uh, the rails and whatnot in, but I guess that's good. So how's your lovely mistress doing today, Strife? She's having a bit of a rough go of it because the cats are... Ratchet specifically is being a bit of an ass. No one ever said that this boy knew how to play nice. He's... Ratchet is having way more trouble adjusting to have another cat in the house than we thought. I guess his, he's just so used to being the, like, king of the castle. You know, that he's he's really, really struggling with it. This like I don't like the way that this looks, quite frankly, the, the, the change between the textures of these blocks. I do not like the way that it looks. There's a really good chance that I'm just going to rip this out once I have a better block to work with or if I can think of a better block. But for the time being, since the south line is not built and there are no rails to actually use, um, this is... Um, this is how it's going to be. And I mean, I suppose if I really wanted to go crazy hard on it, I could just like board this up and like put a sign on it that says under construction. So. Gle greeting time, gladiator. How are you doing? All right, chat. Well, that looks to be everything that I meant to do. Um, Something that I do. Oh, oh, no, no. You know what I need to do? I need to get a couple more birch signs. I need to get a few more birch signs and put them on the uh, the pillars here. Because it's hard to tell which direction you, you're facing whenever you go down into the station. So let's take a nap and let's, um, let's grab a couple of signs and we will uh, rework things. Did I have signs still lying around? That appears to be a negatory. Got some birch here, though. Grab me some signage.
Thanks to you, I've been a Minecraft expert for over a decade. Oh my! Someone you've you've uh, you've watched like my my guide series, for, which is basically a decade old now. I say make it out of bamboo. Nope. Rule like part of part of the rule for everything that I'm doing on, with the underground here is the fact that it has to be made out of stone, some type of stone. And now I am in your YouTube chat. Well, look at you being all fancy. Okay, so let's let's get this little detail here. I say make it out of butt boo. Oh god, butt boo. <laughs> oh my word. Oh jeez. <clears throat> that's that's funny. That's funny. I like it. Um All right, we don't need arrows on these because it's um it's it's pretty obvious with the with the way that the 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 ground is designed that um this is the direction that we're supposed to be going. So, what lines were these? These were east and north. North and east lines. Okay, so how did we do the north and n we go i mean I, that's that's an n for you wait did i do it differently over here how did i do the n over here i did it a I, okay i did it as a one one thick thing Got an N, and the other one was a. It was an E. Okay, it was an East. How do we do this? Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So it's five, four, two, five. Okay, so five, four, two, five. North and east, and over here we have. Uh, how, how do we do this? It's the far one on top. Yeah, it's the far one on top, and then okay, so north and east, and then for over here it is south and west. So south was four three three four. So that's how you do a south. And west was two, two. Okay, well, this is, this is going to be weird. It's made out of entirely twos, pretty much. Um, There we go. Okay. South and west. What if you made the pillars out of melon and the stairs out of bamboo? Cortex, why do you keep suggesting weird? We like who I'm not building out of melons. Would ask 
uh, would ask though are going to make a guide on the new villager update like the updates to the village okay so correct me if i'm wrong about this because i haven't paid super close attention to how they're changing villagers but they're specifically changing the fact that villagers um what professions you get based on where the villagers come from correct me if i'm wrong but that's the way that it is right mainly because funny and funny in my brain you were just you're, you're you're trying to wreck me here cortex you are you are trying your hardest to just utterly wreck me Okay, I am going to use polished granite underneath some of the rail tracks because I forgot to place granite under some of the rail tracks over here. Okay, not this one. Not that one. Uh, the traders that offer, depending on the biome, they're basically... Uh, they basically nerfed it. Yes! Yes! Okay, so... Um, God, that is going to be, that is going to be a hell of a challenge, but, um, here's the deal. Like the, the guide that I made about villager trading has done very poorly. It has done extremely poorly for how, ex uh, for how expensive it was to make and expensive isn't really the altogether best way to describe the words. Okay. So it's activator. Uh, it's detector versus followed by activator. Okay. So, <clears throat> Activator, detector. All right, there we go. Um, basically, it was very expensive to make that guide. And whenever I say expensive, I mean like I put it's it, it took a lot of work. It took a lot of time to make it. And the the like the numbers just aren't there. And a lot of um, a lot of my success on YouTube stems from the fact that I've had um, I've, I've gotten myself into like search results. Uh, several times over and whenever um, you don't get yourself into search results uh, the performance of a video can end up being very poor so it was not worth the effort that I put in to make the uh, the villager trading guide okay the I think it was two of them two villager trading guides so um, for that reason like while the work that I created is something that I'm proud of. Like it's 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 a good guide. It does cover all of the bases for you, um, but it 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 has not performed well. Which basically tells me, okay, well, there's too much competition for this particular tag. I don't think that I can get this out. And um, for that matter, like just to be abundantly clear, Minecraft is a highly competitive. Uh, topic to be making videos about on YouTube. Um, and YouTube in general is just more competitive than ever these days. So um, for that reason, for all of those reasons, I don't think I'll be doing an update. Mostly because the changes that they made, while impactful, they are not um, They, like, I don't think that it's worth redoing the entirety of the series or the videos for the purpose of um, redoing it, basically. Like, it's the, the, it's very small changes that they did, you know? But they did not massively overhaul the system. It is a small tweak that has some pretty significant impact, but that's all that it is. It's a small tweak with a significant impact. Um, the way that you br uh, find villagers, the way you breed them, you know, that hasn't really changed. I wouldn't say do redo the whole thing. That uh, That is a bit extreme. I mean, I don't know how I would... Like, I. Whenever I think about making a guide, 
like, I try to do end-to-end, -end, and that's, that's mostly because of the way that my brain tackles the topic. It's like, no, we need to go end-to-end -end on this. We need to start at the, the, we need to start at square one and explain, like, you don't know what the hell I'm even talking about, you know? You've got no place to start with. And, and we're just going to go straight into it. Like, one of the things that I don't like about a bunch of guides out there is that um, a lot of them just give you the hard, dirty, do this, and, it, and, and that's all you need, you know? But they don't explain the mechanics behind it. They don't give you details like, okay, well, this is what you need. This does this. This does this type thing. I was mostly thinking maybe cover the difference and provide solutions for the differences. Man. I mean, maybe I could. Don't get me wrong. I could absolutely do that. I don't know. I'll have to give it some thought, you know? I'm conflicted about it because, like, and, and like, I, I can be a bit hard-headed about these things. It's like, well, you, you don't have to, like, go jump through all of these hoops to do it in this particular way that you've always done it. And I'm like, yeah, but... But that's the way that I do it. And it's like, that's not a good excuse, especially if you're trying to be adaptable to the, the changing ecosystem of video creation. But God, like, can't teach a, an old dog new tricks type of situation. Suffice to say, making guides over uh, Minecraft is something that interests me less these days than, they, than it has before. Um, but maybe I should give it a shot. To be honest, I was forever grateful for the automatic farm guide. Now I have it memorized. Are you talking about the like the the really like not not super clean guide uh, that um, that came as a product of like that Minecraft Hardcore 1.8? I think it was that I did ages ago. Okay, serious suggestion. What about diorite or andesite? So the problem with diorite and andesite is the fact that I will use polished, I, I prefer to use the polished variant, and there is no, there are no polished stairs in the game, okay? I think that that's due to change soon, but um, there are no polished stairs in the game to my knowledge. Oh my god, they put polished stairs in the game. Okay, nope, nope, that was something that they introduced in a previous. Okay, you make a good point. I could go back and use a diorite or andesite or granite or something like that. <clears throat> well, I'll have to give that a th I'll have to give that some thought next time cuz like it's time for me to stop. The one with the pipes in the back. Ah, yes, yes. I still use that design. I still use that design the, uh, today. Let me grab a little bit more food. In fact, since I'm since I'm down at the end of the stream, um I can go out and I can show you the way that I've re uh re introduced or invented how I how I have reused that design because like that's that that overall design with the pipes at the back it's really really convenient um, and I specifically designed it with the pipes to you know look good whenever you build it above ground but what I prefer to do with that design is to just dig a trench and build it that way it's like it's like all the exact same thing but instead of building it above ground you're building it you know mostly below ground and then covering over the top with glass mostly Well, I stashed my stuff. What we're gonna do is we're gonna head out to uh, we're gonna head out to Crossroads really fast. I do need to repair some of my stuff, so. Curious time, Gladiator. How many times have you come to my stream? Cause it it looks a whole lot like you've been here before, but I don't recall. <clears throat> so I'm gonna close some of these windows. They're just, like, cluttering my screens. My taskbar looks obscenely, like, dense with material. Oh my god, Secrets of Grindia it has hit its 1.0. What in the... They finally released, they finally did it. Eight years later, they have finally done it. They finished Secrets of Grindia. I'm 
The Minecraft guide is how I found you all those years ago. Cool. What's that? Um, Cortex, Secrets of Grindia, do you ever remember something called Steam Greenlight? If you don't, I'll comple I completely understand. But if you ever heard of Steam Greenlight, it was basically this system. It was before Steam opened the floodgates and they were like, anybody can publish on our platform. They were more selective about what could get onto Steam. And Steam Greenlight was, okay, well, we're going to have this system where people submit the games and the community will vote on what games that we're going to approve to be sold on Steam. Um, so Secrets of Grindia was one of the first rounds of um, Steam Greenlight, uh, you know, releases. It was, it was put out so long ago. It's such an old game that I, uh, I played this with Kim, Rhythian, and Zoe when I was with the Yogg's cast. I believe those, like, if you go over, if you, if you go and find Kim's channel and you search Secrets of Grindia, you'll probably find the series that we did, which, you know, su subsequently ended kind of soon. So, because it was, you know, an incomplete game. Yeah, I'm a youngin, so I have no idea what Street Steam Greenlight is. Well, yeah, well, there you go. There you go. That's, that's your uh, answer. FNAF was on Steam Greenlight back in 2014. The flow of time is insane. Yes, yes it is. So like, Steam Greenlight, you know, it was originally like, okay, well, here's here's what we have available. You can go ahead and, you know, vote on it. And they would do it in rounds of releases of like, okay, these are the things that, and they would usually do something in the la along the lines of 100 games. Uh, that would be, you know, like, okay, well, these are now for, these are, our, these are the new Greenlight games. And I remember specifically... These days, the way that I start my day is I get my coffee and I sit down and I listen to the news. I remember back then I would sit down, get my coffee, and I would go through Steam Greenlight because it, it would take time to really give attention to these games. There were few enough games being published. And that's what I would do. I would be like, okay, well, what's on, what's on the green light today? <clears throat> and I think that may have been the way that I found out about um, uh, Stardew Valley. Because Stardew Valley was a game that I was I was following the development of that game for two years before its release from uh, by Concern Dave. I was very very interested in that game, but anyways, Greenlight happened and they would you know put out you know like a, about a hundred games per uh, uh, you know release schedule or whatever, and Secrets of Grindia was in well, either in the first hundred or the second hundred that they ever did, and it has been just kind of stuck in that hellish landscape of perpetual development for so long so long so to see secrets of grindia now in a 1.0 release i'm like oh my god that means i can go back and play this game start to finish which i would i, I want to do because it was a very endearing game back whenever i did play it you know so still got my copy and it's on sale for about $13.50, you know? Okay, let's close some of, some more of these freaking windows that I don't need open. Close out the spicy pictures. <clears throat> That's right, chat. If you're if 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 you've only just shown up um, and you're interested, um, donations came through again. You can go ahead and check out new uh, you know saucy pictures if you type in exclamation uh, pics. <clears throat> and if you missed any of the pics because some of them have come out rather quickly, uh, you can also type in exclamation gallery. I'm back, just got a cold one, like you used to say. Yes. Cold ones are so good, especially whenever it's the middle of the summer. Or if you're, like, where I am, and spring is basically early summer. Um, <clears throat> also, there's been a, there's been a bit of a, an alteration in our, uh, our, our plan design, as it were, okay? 
if you are interested, um, those of you who know what hundos do on this stream, they're getting a bit of a mix-up now. They're, they're, they're getting a little bit of a, a variation added to them. Hundos don't just do what they normally do. Now you are given a choice in regards to what they do. Hundos could potentially get me to pull something out of the wardrobe and put it on. The many costumes that have been gifted to me over the years. Alright, crossroads it is. The farm is very flexible and you can build it very quickly. Yes, you can. Here at Crossroads, I, uh, I initially was using diamond farms. But I ended up uh, deciding that that was not really um, all that efficient. So I rebuilt the tier farm. <clears throat> Tev gave me a bit of a hand. But this is the tier farm that was built again. And um, we have access tunnels over here. We rebuilt the tier farm. Yes, Tev. Yes, I know. So, you know, the whole thing is here. Got the stuff along the back. And it's it, it fits into a flat space. So, and you've got your trigger buttons over here to uh, to activate the washing system to get the crops out. And <clears throat> I've got a piping system that washes everything down and up into the chests over here. So, I'm going to have to make use of this before long. Um, actually, while I'm here, uh, I'm probably just going to log out here and... Spend some time trading with the villagers to get my uh, my stuff patched back up because I could use some more emeralds. There's nothing wrong with having more emeralds here. Oh my god is is the is the system utterly? No, it's not backed up anymore. So it's only Achilles' heel if that it only really supports up to two players max. <clears throat> Man. Well, I may as well take a nap downstairs and, and set my spawn point. This is a good place for me to stop, chat. I am very hopeful that we're going to move on to uh, Final Fantasy Rebirth come Saturday. Because um, I really want to get my hands on that game. I really want to get my hands on it. I really want to play it. That is the next major thing that I am intending to play on this channel. But... Like I've said previously, I'm still trying to work my way through uh, the remake one more time before playing uh, Rebirth. So, that's taking me longer than I thought. Mostly because re Remake is... It is... It is actually pretty big. It's pretty big. And and frankly, I think it's stretched out a little bit too much. Nice catching you, Will. Catch up later. Nice to see you. It was nice to have you along for the ride. Even a little bit there, Time Gladiator. Enjoy the rest of your day. Go ahead and save all. Okay, chat. Thank you so much for the donations. Thank you so much for the tips. Uh, thank you so much for the subscriptions and or resubscriptions. And to everybody who followed while I was doing the stream, thanks so much. I'm glad to see that, uh, you know, I'm worth following. <clears throat> I will see all of you um, for another stream another time. Until then, take care of yourselves. Stay happy and stay healthy. I will be back on Saturday at noon. Um, and there's always a possibility that you will see me uh, over on Tev's channel. Um, go ahead and shout out Jan Tevla. Uh, she, uh, she streams on Wednesdays typically. Um, you can go ahead and uh, follow her. There's usually when she streams, I, I stream. With, I'm 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 there with her. Um, <clears throat> Wednesday nights typically is uh, is when you'll see that. But in any case, thank you so much for watching, everybody. I will see you Saturday, hopefully for a different game. But until then, take care of yourselves, stay happy, stay healthy, and I'll catch you later. Mm -hmm.